Hello, I'm Seek97. Today I'm going to show you how to create a texture pack for Minecraft 1.3.1. So the first thing you need to do is go to Start, Run, and type into the search box percent app data percent and hit Enter. Now go to the folder .minecraft, then to bin, and then find Minecraft.jar and open it with 7-zip or WinRAR. And for this example, I'll be opening it with WinRAR. Now create a new folder on your desktop or wherever, so a new folder and call it my texture pack. Now open this folder that you've created and just drag that to one side and the WinRAR archiver to the other. So now we need to copy some folders and files over, so first we do the folders and the folders you need to copy over to your my texture pack folder are achievement, armor, art, environment, uh, GUI, item, misc, mob, terrain and finally title. So just hold control and select those and then just drag them over to here and allow them to copy. And now what you want to do is move um, copy over the files to this um, folder. So you want to go to it, it says type and click that so the arrow is pointing up and then scroll all the way to the bottom and you'll find some files here that are different from the classes and what you want to copy over is pack terrain, particles and pack, so just select those and drag them over. TMI is from a mod I've installed and font, it's just got some writing in that you can't really edit texture pack wise. So now you can close this WinRAR archiver. So now we can go on and edit our file, so like the PNG images, you can just edit those to change whatever. So what I'm going to do just for the purpose of this is go into the terrain.png, find the front of the furnace, uh, idle, so not with in it and I'm just gonna recolor that blue. So it's control shift and F5 colour and select blue. And that'll fill that in and then save it. And so if I go back to my texture pack folder and go open terrain, you see that the blue has changed there. Now the next thing I'm going to edit is this file called pack.png. So as you can see it's just like uh, pick like a screenshot from Minecraft, but that's basically the picture that will appear next to your texture pack in the texture packs folder of Minecraft. So we can edit that. So what we could do is just fill it in. So Control All, and then fill with blue color, and then we could get some text, make it white, and just put my texture pack, resize it center of it and yeah and that's basically what's going to appear next to our texture pack in the in-game texture pack folder so we could save that as png and overwrite the existing one and that is saved oh wait sorry click ok and that is saved onto this now what this pack dex document is, is the description slash, that's it, actually just a description of the texture pack because what we will call it in a next step is going to be the name of it, so description test texture pack. And save that and that will be like the description of our texture. Now to turn these texture files into something that we can put into Minecraft and load up, um, well, what we have to do is to create a new zip document. So go for, right click, click new, and WinRAR zip archive, and just call it or oh, the name of your texture pack. So let's call it Awesome Pack Test. And then what we need to do is not drag in the folder, but actually drag in the content. So we need to drag all of these into that zip. So if we go into that now, we can see it's got the folders and the textures and that pack dot text. So that's uh texture pack created. Now to install it, um, if you've watched my recent video you know how to, but just to quickly show you, go to that .minecraft folder from the app data and then go into texture packs and drag in that zip archive into there and that's your texture pack installed into the game. Now to load this texture up in game, we need to go into Minecraft and go to texture packs and as you can see it's right there, awesome pack test because that was the name of it. Test texture pack was the description of that pack text and then it says in my texture pack was that pack.png so we click that and if it's selected in that box it means that texture pack has been added to our Minecraft. 
Now, if you remembered when I edited the texture pack, just for examples, um, I edited the front of the furnace to be blue. So if you go into a game, um, a world, sorry, and I've got a furnace in, you can see the front's blue on the kind of item preview. But if I put it down, you can see it's blue. So the put the front always points to you, and it's blue because I edited that to be blue. Thanks for watching. If this video helped, please like it. If you've got any more questions, put them in the comment section below. And please subscribe to my channel as that really helps me.